this is a quick compilation video of Herman cutting out this pumpkin. You can see where I've dr drawn right on the pumpkin. And this first part of the video is just starting it from the edge and he's doing up the straight cups right up, up the side. You'll notice he's got a cast on his hand. On this one here, Herman, you're, you've started the leaves and you're making like a hole at the end? Yes. The reason for that is I can go, I go on the outside of the line and cut, cut, cut back in again so I can make a more intricate cut. Without yes. having to cut in from the edge? Right. And it saves the blade. Okay, so you're just doing another one here, right? Right. Making a hole. Okay, and then you'll go around. See the one there, the next hole in the corner? You'll do the same thing in that corner as well? Yes. Okay. Takes time, but it's easier than slicing right from the edge of the board when you got a two or three foot slice in, eh? Yes. Okay. I can see here on the video that it shows you how far he would have had to cut into that edge. So you're going to go around and then cut, cut off around that leaf and the other leaf. And then once you got it cut off, here's the next leaf you're starting in. And I've seen you cut off part of the section, but this is just a different technique. Yes, and it's a closer cut from the edge. Okay, so what are you doing here? I'm making a slot so I can turn the blade. So you're just going to make like two little cuts between? Right. Okay, well, check. See what you're doing. So you slit, you slit them like wide enough that you'll be able to put the blade between there once you're done, eh? Correct. So you just do snap it out of there? Cool. Yes. Okay. And then you'll be able to cut in those other two parts of the leaves from the end. Correct, yeah. Okay, I see what you're doing. So in this one here, all you're showing is that it's okay. Snazzy cast there, Herman. So you're showing that it's okay to cut from both directions? You don't have to just follow? It's just like whatever works, eh? Right. Okay. What's easiest for the person using the saw. Okay. This here final one I put in because if you come wait for a second, he's just cruising around the corner here, but you're going to see the jigsaw start to jump. And this is what I have trouble with. See it jumping there? That meant the blade was catching too much and it was in danger of breaking. So you backed off and then come at it again? Yes. 